Welcome to Excel in a minute. Do you have a result to a formula, but you are unsure of what input value the formula needs to get that result? Well, if you are, you're in luck. Because in this lesson, we are going to learn how to use the Goal Seek feature in Excel. Goal Seek can solve for the value needed in a formula that has a predetermined result. Consider this table that calculates the profit earned for the number of items sold at a suggested retail price minus the discount percentage. As an example, let's key in 500 for the number of items sold, $25 for the retail price, and a 10% discount rate. And we get a profit of $11,250. Now, what if we want to know how many items must be sold to get a profit of $30,000? Simply go to the Data tab, Click the What If Analysis button and select Goal Seek. In the dialog box, select the value that you want to set. So, for this example, we set cell C8 since we want to set the profit to $30,000. And for the changing cell, we select cell C5 since we want to know how many items are needed to achieve the goal. And Goal Seek returns 1,333. There you have it. Goal Seeks works best when you know the result of a formula already. But take note that Goal Seek can only look for one variable at a time. Thank you for your time. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Excel in a minute. You may also check out the link below to download the presentation. We hope to see you in the next lesson.